Okay, we're back. I'm already up to 97. So we're gonna crank out the last three. As you can see here, see how the, there's the needle and it's taking down the thread or the yarn. I'm going to make sure that this last one, the one we started off with, is down. Now what you're going to do is you're going to take your yarn here and you're going to pull out a little bit and then we're going to cut it. prepared. Okay, so we're going to clip our yarn. Thread your needle. And we're going to take the stitches off. So you're going to release your yarn. You have this one here, close up. so we know that one's down, that one's a secure stitch. The rest of them we're going to pull up with our needle. So once the needle is down in the down position, you're going to collect it on your needle. A couple of them, especially on the large one, you have to take off individually for the first few. Then after that, you just push the needle down. Collect the stitch, pull it through. Oops. And you'll feel it getting a little tight, so that means you just gotta pull them through. This one's going to be a toughie for us. There we go. You want to catch that before it comes off. And now we're back. So I'm going to take my machine and move it to the side. It's much easier when you secure it. Now here we're going to pull and we'll do a cinch for the toe. I like it better. I don't have any seams around my toes just cinch it so it's nice and tight put your needle through you can also use a metal needle what i do here is wrap twice pull it through make sure that my yarn is at the toe and then tighten it and then you're going to do it one more time Put through, come on, wrap twice, pull it through, make sure your yarn is at the top, there you go. At this point, I will snip my yarn, got a 
little straggler there. That's okay. Take a crochet hook. Sorry there. Grab the end. There we go. Pull it through. Like that. Okay, it's much easier said than done in this case. There we go. And then I'll get that to the inside. All right, this is this is a little getting a little crazy here. But that's okay. We all have our crazy days. Wrap it around, pull it through, there we go. You can make it shorter also. Now what I do here is I flip it and see how this is kind of loose? I'll just put it around a couple of times to make a knot or a slip knot type thing. Then I take my hook, put it through in between, come out to where that is. Let's see if I can do this any better than the toe. Hook my yarn, pull it through to the middle. Apparently pulling through is not my thing today. Here we go. I pull it out to the other side, stretch it, and then clip it just close so that it sucks itself inside. That is your hung hem with your toe, cinch toe, your hem, and your sock. I hope this video was helpful. Once I get used to doing videos, I'll do some more and it'll probably be a little bit of easier of a process. Thank you guys. Have a great day.